Hey, I'm Matt from Red Tip Productions, and this is Henry's One Shot Three Ways. I'm a cinematographer that loves to shoot a wide variety of projects to always keep my work fresh and exciting. But today, we're going to be relating our approach to music videos. We're going to be looking at how one subject, shot with three different compositions, can convey three different meanings to an audience. Before composing your image, it is crucial to understand the rule of thirds. This rule is an imaginary set of vertical and horizontal lines that run across the screen. It is typically used to help us compose our shots so that they are visually pleasing to the human eye. However, when a cinematographer chooses to break these rules, it can sometimes signify a new kind of message to the audience. To really focus on framing shots specifically, I'm choosing to shoot on my Sony A7S Mark II with a 16 to 35 millimeter lens remaining fixed at 35 millimeters. All right, firstly, let's look at the wide shot. This type of shot is used as a way to convey a large amount of information to the audience. A wide shot will usually show the subject's entire body, as well as the location that they're in. For the music video that we're shooting today, a wide shot of the scene will help to translate to the audience a sense of spatial awareness or just general scene setting. It'll also allow the audience to see the full body characteristics or mannerisms of the artist as they perform. So for an untraditional wide shot, let's look at a Dutch angle. What is that telling the audience? It's important to think critically about everything that we place in the frame. Basically what a Dutch angle is, is when you tilt the camera slightly off its horizon line and uh, this portrays an uneasy feeling to the audience. All right, so the medium shot is traditionally from the hips up when you're shooting a subject. The medium shot is a great way to get close to the subject so that the audience can gain some information about them. However, this shot can still convey lots of information about their surroundings. A quick and easy way to make the medium shot slightly more unique and interesting is by lowering the camera. Let's take a look at how a low angle medium shot can give power to the subject performing. It can make the artist seem larger. This is very important in a music video as we usually want the artist to be seen as an important figure. Now, let's look at the close-up. Here is a profile close-up. A close-up is the best way to capture the emotion of the artist as they perform their song. Deciding to shoot a close-up that only shows one side of the subject's face can help convey a sense of mystery. And there you have it. Three shot sizes giving one shot three separate meanings. Now, with all that being said, it's important to remember to always think critically about what each frame you create is telling the audience. It is up to you to decide what's right and what isn't. Some rules are just meant to be broken. Trust yourself and be creative. I'm Matt Teepold, and this has been Henry's One Shot Three Ways.